What up guys, welcome back to another episode of Greedfall. Last time we left off, uh, my brother was looking a little scary, like a zombie. So uh, we need to find a cure for him. He has now the Malachor. So there was one quest to go find the healer. She, uh, what? This chick said that she could, this healer was unbelievable. And I thought that was a better avenue more than the Petrus guy, because I don't really like that crazy religion, so. We're gonna see if this is worth it. Quiz! Get out! Who do you think you are to defoil our ritual? One of those moin shakers, no doubt. Aiden, it is your duty to assure we are not interrupted. A thousand pardons, Tian. It is indeed one of those moin shakers. A moin shaker? Look at him more closely, Aiden. He is a normal Maui. Present yourself and tell me why you interrupt our ceremony. My name is Desarde. I have come looking for you to ask for your help. I greet you, Donegad. We are so sorry to have interrupted your ritual, but my friend truly needs your advice. Don't excuse yourself. Are you the daughter of Bladnid? Are you not a Donegad as well? It is true, but my powers of healing are far less powerful than your own. Then. How can I help you? My cousin suffers from a terrible sickness. The Malachor. I do not know this sickness. But perhaps we call it by a different name. It turns the blood black and provokes terrible suffering. And alas, it is fatal in all cases. We've never seen the alien touched by such a sickness. And I doubt I am able to heal your cousin. We are looking for a remedy. But urgently need to relieve his pain. Could you slow the progression of the sickness? Keep him from suffering? In that, I can help you. I know how to make one forget the pain, even the most severely wounded. But Tiern, with all that is happening now, you... Alright, try to restart everything, so let's see if that makes it a little bit smoother. Hopefully. Okay, so we have a quest right here, talk to the hunter, but I guess it's not the one we're trying to do. Ask for the help of Sir Lelius. Or should we start this? No, let's continue on with the one we're already doing. So let's fast travel. Alright, so where I gathered is we need help. These one guys are probably quote unquote converting. They're probably killing those native dudes. So we need to investigate, help him out. Oh, hello. Excuse me, are you Cecilius, the famous healer? I am a healer only through the grace of the Illuminated. What can I do for you, my child? My cousin, the governor of New Serene, is in dreadful pain. Well, that's terribly sad. Was he wounded in combat? Was it during the coin guard's rebellion? Alas, no. He is afflicted with the Malagor, and his days are numbered. We're looking for a cure, but... Now that's a true miracle that you require. And I fear that they're extremely rare in these pagan lands. Is your faith so fragile that the fear of failure paralyzes you? Do you not think that my cousin's illness could be a test? Not for us, but for you. There's some truth in that. You're right. I shouldn't allow myself to be so easily defeated. Very good. I'll go to New Serene and try to ease the governor's pain. But do not feed on vain hopes. There are trials that we must accept to undertake with humility. A thousand thanks, Cecilius. May the Illuminated go with you, my child. There is no miracle that he cannot accomplish. I will pray that you find this cure that we need so desperately. I have not lost hope. Okay, so somehow I switched quest and I went to the other side, I feel like. Um, oh no, or that was just part of it. Talk to the missionaries. Okay. So 
teammates outside of this place. Alright, and we're back to the village. Good day. Are you the master hunter? Beo til tu madre, Nike. I am indeed one and the same person. What do you want from me? The Dunaigan, Katasach, spoke to me about the animal attacks. Can you tell me more? The Ten Lands have been angered. They are very angry. The beasts have always lived here. But they only attack if we tread near their nest. Of late, they attack on sight. There have been many wounded, and some of our young have even disappeared. It may be that the Tenlands killed them, but it is also possible they followed the missionaries. Oof. What can you tell me about the Tenlands? They are normally very peaceful creatures, very calm, but who defend their young with fury. During the attacks, I noticed that they were not all the same. Not all from the same nest. What do you mean? That the other beasts don't come from here, but from other places. And that they are coming more and more often. Were there many victims? Many wounded. Thanks to the healing powers of the Donegan, they survived. But the attacks happen more and more often. And they come with greater fury. I try to chase them away, to destroy any nests that I found, but still, more of them come, and now our children disappear. The stress alone could kill our village. Can you tell me who the children are? A young fisherman and a gatherer. You will find the sister of the woman and the brother of the man in the village. I will go and see them. Isn't it odd that these creatures who are normally passive have become so aggressive? Yes. Yes. This has never happened in my lifetime. What do you know? Speak. Lives are at risk. I do not speak of things I am not sure of. The Renaik say, like you, do not understand the bond we have with nature. I believe I can help you in your fight against the Tenlands. How would you advise me to go about it? You must destroy their nests. It's sad, but the only way to stop their numbers growing. There are most likely three around here. I can point you in the direction to one that I discovered. I would have taken care of it, but my village cannot spare my presence here. I must keep watch. I did not find the two others. Some in the village may know where to find them. Mm. And how would I go about destroying the nests? You must burn them and kill the dominant one. Or else they will build again. We see them especially at dawn. After that, we no longer see them. But be careful, Renaxi. The night belongs to the Tenlands. That is when they are most awake. Going out at night is very dangerous. I thank you for your advice. We shall go and destroy these nests, Kandor. Just on talking about the creatures. Chris proposed to help speak about the mission. What do you know about the missionaries? The Moine Shakers. They came here before the attacks of the Tenlands and buzz around us like flies. They speak of light, of demons, and the soul. Their words make little sense. All that they want is for us to join their village and that we serve them as if they were Tier. They want to make us renike say. They want to sever our bond with our lands. Their words do not touch those old enough to understand. But the young are sometimes swayed and listen. 
They follow them to their Eden village. And they become their servants. Their bone is cut. Have you tried to fight? No. But some have fought. Because they treat the young girls badly. Mm -hmm. I think if not for the attacks, no one would have turned to them and their light. But hope fled our village. And the weak of courage have doubts and listen to their lies. It sounds as if the attacks began at a timely moment for the missionaries. I must be going. Katasach advised us to speak with the families of those missing. Perhaps they might know where the tenants have built their nests. I don't know where to find fire though. Destroy the nest. That guy's accent was really weird. Good day. I've been sent here by your Denega. He asked me to help you. I hope he is right and that you are not like the Moin Shakers. My sister has gone missing. It is for that very reason that I am here. To attempt to find her or to understand what has happened. Then I will tell you what I know. Your sister. What does she look like? She is a very beautiful young woman. Kind and sweet. I miss her so very much. Is she very careful? Does she know she should be wary of the beasts? Oh yes, she knows it very well. But she has been star-eyed of late. And the stars make you forget all caution. How long has she been missing? Two nights have gone by since. She told me that she was going to gather berries. It was early in the day, but she never returned. I called for her from the edge of the village, in vain, and the ten lands were roaming. Do you know where she usually goes picking? Certainly, in the clearing. We find a great many berries there. Is there anyone in the village that might want to harm her? No, no, everyone loves her. Maybe a little too much. Why do you say that? She is beautiful and young. The mind shakers took notice. And the boys of the village did as well. What do you mm. think is likely happened? She might have been attacked by the Tenlands. But it was early and they come out mostly at night. You think it might have been something else? I hope. Even if it is a strange hope. Perhaps she was taken by the mind shakers. They were pestering her the other day. They behaved without respect. A boy intervened and chased them off. But you think that they might have captured her when she was outside of the village? That merits inspection. I must leave now. I feel like I still have no idea what's going on, but... I have to destroy some mess at, during the day with some fire. And, um, yeah. Don't have any of those. I don't have fires, so I don't know what to do. Good day. My name is Desarde from the congregation. I've been told that someone dear to you has disappeared. Yes, my little brother. He left to go fishing, like every day, and he did not return. Your Denegar asked me to help you. Any information you can give me will be very useful. This is true. I hope your words to be heartfelt. My insides are twisting in fear that my brother is lost. Can you describe your brother for me? He is young, rather tall and strong. The girls find him handsome. He is such a nice boy, but he is wild off the tether. And often his curiosity gets him in trouble. Can you tell me more precisely when he disappeared? Where? And under what circumstances? It was two days past. I saw him leave to go fishing, as he was often to do. And you cannot remember anything out of the ordinary? No. He was full of joy. Full of life. I am so worried about him. So why couldn't they have just hooked up that one girl with this guy? Did your brother have any enemies? No. I can't think of anyone who would plant strangle beets in his garden. Perhaps a youthful rivalry. He didn't get along particularly well with the master hunter. But it was 
Does not take serious. Perhaps the missionaries. He did get into a fight with them. But they surely wouldn't have taken him. That's still a lead. Was he close to anyone? He has been dreamy and more joyful than usual. Those are the signs of someone stricken with love. But he no longer wants to share secrets with me. He told me that he has grown beyond the shadow of his brother. And the birds in his branches are his. And what do you think most likely happened to him? He could have come face to face with Tenlands. They've become angry of late. But he knew how to avoid them. He might have had a run-in with the Mind Shakers as well. He got into a fight with them a while back. He already went over this. Because of a young girl in our village. You think the missionaries might have sought vengeance? I don't know. But he might have went to find them in their village. He bears no good feelings towards them. I will go and see. Maybe they can tell me more. I must be leaving. All right, find and destroy the nests requires alchemy preparation of elemental damage. Oh, I'm gonna have to figure out how to make that. What? What's going on? Oh my gosh. I don't know you guys right outside the village. Man, these guys are strong. Man, they are tickles them. But it's still it's fun at the same time. I like the balance. care of it. Wait. What are we doing back here? I guess we have to charge it up with this light again. Do you have any news? Do you know where my sister is? Not yet, but I've not given up the search. Was your sister fond of a young fisherman who also disappeared by any chance? Did they have known each other since they were little? Like all the children of the village, they have always been friends. Only friends? Yes. He defended her when the mind shakers wanted to take her. But she is promised to another. I couldn't care less about her reputation. An engagement can be broken. If you know anything at all... I have told you all I know. My sister is certainly wounded somewhere, or taken by the Mind Shakers. Very well. Time to get on with my investigations. Uh-huh. Sounds like I'm to me leader. they ran off together. Okay, so I don't know why it's asking for that. I think 
think I'm going to stop right here, though, guys. If you enjoyed, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you're new and you want to subscribe, I really appreciate it, though. And have a good day. Let the animals...